This is my solution to CTF Learn basic injection problem. The description says, see if you can leak the whole database. The flag is in there somewhere. Okay, so here it is. First things first, let's inspect. Okay, let's go to source. All right, so we got try some names. Hiroki, Noah, and Luke. All right, why not? Hiroki. Zero results. No. Zero results. Luke. As you saw before, this one actually returns a result. So it returns a name and the data. Um, okay. So after Googling around some SQL syntax and such and some SQL queries, uh, my big my best guess is they're performing a query that looks something like this. So it's gonna select star from let's say the database is users, right? Where to the name of the table, sorry, it's users. Or username equals that. And this is where they're gonna put um, our input. It's gonna go right between here. So the best way to bypass this, I found out, is what we're gonna do is we're gonna end the string and we're gonna put or true at the end. Right? So this is all we're gonna need. This left part is what they have on the back end. That's the query they're running. Try this out. So this is kind of the sneaky part. So anything ORed with true is always going to return true, obviously. Uh, so this means the query, every row is going to pass the query and it's going to return every row in the database. So let's try and submit this and see what we get. Okay, there's the entire database. And as you can see, the flag is right here. There you go.